Welcome back to Dash News Network. Today we will be going to St. Luke's Lutheran Church. So come along with us. First, you'll be invited by the large steeple. As you go down, you'll notice how large the beautiful church is. You'll then see all the beautiful plant scenery around it. Today, we will be interviewing Mr. Jerry Mears, the Director of Youth Services here. So, how many years have you been working at St. Luke's? Um, working as youth director, three. I've been volunteering for 30 years. Okay. What is your favorite part of working at St. Luke's Lutheran Church? I love working with the high school and middle school youth, um, having a chance to interact, to teach them, to learn from them, and get to know them. What is your, what is the most interesting part of St. Luke's? Ooh. For me, everything still comes down to the youth. They are what has kept me going to church here. Um, the first few years that I volunteered, I worked with younger kids and then was approached about doing eighth grade, which I resisted for, at first, uh, but I found to be a marvelous experience. Eighth graders are always fresh and new. They're always challenging. They look at new ideas. Mm -hmm. There's always a push, so it helps keep my mind more aware, keeps me more up on current things, and makes me have to think and rethink my view on the world, uh, my faith, and my approach to the world in general. How would you say St. Luke's has changed since you started working here? Oh, there have been numerous changes. Um, in the building, we've gone through numerous pastors and um, in the last decade, there have been a lot of changes in pastors, which has changed the personality of the congregation to an extent. As some people left during all of the chaos, other people stepped up and took on bigger roles within the church. Um, also, not long after, or around the time that I joined the church, the ELCA headquarters opened uh, near here. And what happened is that St. Luke suddenly got an influx of people who work for the ELCA churchwide organization. So we had a large number of people who are ministers or other types of workers for the ELCA and have an, a religious background that brought a different approach to things. What inspired you to take this position at the church? Um, as youth director, uh, we were going through yet another change, a pastor who was leaving that people, it was felt would leave people very upset and feeling the youth once again, we're going to be kind of dangling. And it was I was approached and asked to do it because rather than have yet another youth director, we tend to go through, youth directors tend to be here a couple of years. And by the time people get used to them, they're leaving. And it was felt to help not be quite so chaotic and leave people so unsure, we could have a youth director that families and youth already knew and were trusted and were fairly comfortable with. So that's how it was presented to me, and that's what made it made me decide to go ahead and take it. What is something that you look forward to when you come to St. Luke's every day? There are two things. Seeing the people here, um, it's a place that I find welcoming. There are always people that I enjoy seeing, and it's a place that I can come and kind of let go of all the things that are bothering me outside. I can come here. Thank you for your time, Mr. Mears. Thank you very much.